Hello and uh, welcome to this additional and bonus lecture on leveraging digital tools, digital tools and platform for excellence in problem solving and critical thinking. So in this uh, section, we will keep uh, adding more things that can help you learn about more ways and strategies to build excellence in addition to what we have already said. And in this particular lecture, we will talk about how to leverage digital tools and platforms to analyze complex issues and derive solutions. Ready for that? So what do you think? How do you think uh, how to leverage digital tools and platforms? Okay. So leveraging these tools to analyze complex issues and derive solution is a critical skill as it has emerged over the years now in a fast paced and interconnected economy and world. Now there are a few strategies and steps that you can use effectively uh, uh, where you can use digital tools for problem solving and let's take a look at each of these. The first thing that is obvious is you need to define the problem clearly before diving into digital analysis Ensure that you have a clear understanding of the problem at the hand, define the problem statement, objectives, and desired outcomes. So that is the first step. Uh, then you need to identify relevant digital tools. You know, you need to have examples and these typical selection based aligned to the nature of problems. Now examples could include data analytics tools uh, like uh, Excel and Tableau. Uh, collaboration platforms like Slack and Microsoft, project management tools like Trello and Asana, and communication tools like Zoom and Microsoft. So identifying these relevant digital tools goes across all kinds, not only to analytical tools, but also collaboration, project management, and communication tools, because that's how those are the resources you will need to solve complex problems. Uh, you need to again uh, gather relevant data from various sources. <coughs> digital tools can help aggregate and uh, organize data efficiently, ensure data collected is accurate, <coughs> up to date, and aligned with the problem solving objectives because that will determine how well will you be able to solve the problem and find a good solution. Use data analytics tools to analyze and uh, interpret the collected data. The techniques may include statistical analysis, trend analysis, predictive uh, modeling. Tools like uh, uh, Python, R, or any specialized analytical pla analytics platform also would be valuable. So look for these tools and techniques for the data analysis you need to. Uh, you also need to pay, uh, think about data visualization. So create visual representative data to facilitate uh, understanding. Now, data visualization tools uh, like Tableau, Power BI, or Google Data Studio. These uh, uh, data can help you transform the complex data set into meaningful charts and dashboards. And that will help you uh, get insights to solve your problem. Collaborative plat platforms is another thing. So utilize uh, collaborative platforms to engage team members in real-time discussions and problem solving. Share insights, findings, and updates using tools like Slack, Microsoft Teams, and other pro project collaboration talk, uh, tools and platforms as we talked in the earlier slide also. Uh, you also need to employ project management tools to organize tasks, uh, deadlines, and track progresses. Tools like Trello, Asana or Jira can help manage the workflow and ensure that everyone is aligned towards the solution. Remote collaboration tools is another thing. If the team is working remotely, leverage tools that uh, facilitate virtual collaboration. Video conferencing tools like uh, Zoom, Microsoft Teams, file sharing platforms like Google Drive, Dropbox, and collaborative document editing tools like Google Docs and Microsoft 365 would be very useful. Uh, cloud computing is, ha, has, its, uh, has come to stay. Take advantage of cloud computing services for scalable and flexible storage and processing capabilities. Platforms like AWS, Azure, and Google Cloud can, Google cloud can support large-scale data processing and analysis. 
Machine learning and AI again has come to stay. Explore machine learning and artificial algorithms for advanced analysis. Now these tools can identify patterns, make predictions, and automate certain aspects of problem solving. Learnings like TensorFlow and Scikit-learn can be used for. S-C-I-K-I-T, I don't know how to really pronounce it. Scikit probably, yeah. Digital feedback loops is another important thing that is uh, gaining momentum in, in the advanced frontier of problem solving. Establish feedback loop within your digital tools to iterate on the solutions. Remember, within your digital tools to get feedback on your to iterate on solution. Regularly review and analyze the effectiveness of the implemented solutions and make adjustments as needed. You can read through this uh, the document here, which illustrates how uh, from uh, from a non-digital uh, feedback loop to a digital within the loop you can use and how a company has used this to find solutions more effectively and more efficiently. Remote collaboration tools are another important things to use. You need to pay attention to security and privacy aspects of the digital tools, especially when dealing with sensitive data. And data is becoming more and more sensitive. Ensure that the chosen tools comply with relevant regulation and security standards. Invest in training and skill development for team members to maximize the effective use of data digital tools. The tools by themselves can't do anything. The better the trained and skilled your team members are to use them, better results you'll get. Familiarity, familiarity with tools capability will enhance the efficiency of the problem solving process. Document the entire problem solving process, including the tools used, methodologies applied and key findings. Now, this documentation will serve as a valuable resource for future references and for making continuous improvement. Keep abreast of new digital tools and technologies that can enhance your problem solving capabilities. Subscribe to relevant publications, attend webinars, participate in professional developments to stay informed. The world is changing very fast. So by combining digital tools with effective problem solving methodologies, you need to combine both. Teams can efficiently analyze complex issues and derive innovative solutions. The key is to use these tools strategically in the right manner, ensuring that they align with the specific needs of the problem at hand. Very important. So thank you so much for watching this additional and bonus lecture on uh, leveraging digital tools and platform for excellence in problem solving and critical thinking. I hope you have learned a lot of new things again. And I do look forward to seeing you again somewhere and uh, keep talking to you.